Hello, this is Rodolfo Silva, and welcome to another Ask ZBrush quick tip for desktop. So let's take a look at how to create a matcap material that mimics a PBR material from another rendering application. So the first thing you need to do is actually load up your model and go over here to the material palette and choose any of these matcap materials. If we go over to our material palette and then access this modifier sub palette, scroll all the way down and you can see that there's an image down below, which is usually either one or two spheres. Now I'm going to load a material here. And I'm going to load this matcap gray and I'm going to select that image and you can see there's a single sphere that's cropped on both left and right and top and bottom. If I just replace this sphere with another sphere from another different application such as this redshift sphere or this Unreal Engine sphere that I tweaked in the material editor, all we need to do is screen grab that sphere on your source application such as Unreal or Redshift in Cinema 4D and then crop the edges top, bottom, left and right by at least one pixel and then replace the sphere image in our modifier sub palette to that cropped image that you just grabbed from your source application. And now we have that matcap material behaving exactly like it would in your render application but inside a ZBrush and this means we can actually start sculpting directly on a mimicked PBR material.